Hey everyone, it's PJD here, and now I just want to show you my Black Friday haul part two. Um, everything did not arrive yet, but no sense suspending things because you know the post post office. You never know when certain things will arrive, and I don't want to have January 2010 upon us, and I'm still doing Black Friday hauls. So um, the only things I'm waiting for would be let's see, Afro Veda got a couple of shampoo bars and conditioner some things like that from Afro Veda and Rosalind scents which I believe the confirmation said it shipped so I should get that soon and oh a dress that I ordered but that wasn't anything I was going to show anyway so yeah so that would end it so this is the bulk of my Black Friday part two stuff the majority has arrived so now I'm just going to show you first let's do Oyen which is well I'll do a Veda first it's a very quick little thing. I reviewed this in the past. It's the Damage Remedy Intensive Restructuring Treatment. Works very well on the hair. I, I have posts on this. So I got one tube of this. And then I got a couple of little free samples they sent me. So that's good. Oyen. First time ever I've purchased their um, Funk Butter. So it's a cream, like natural deodorant. So I can't wait to try that. Comes in this little tin. So I'm excited. This is the Uber Pool Bar. It's a shampoo bar. See if you can get a feel for the size of it. Okay. All right, so I'll probably just, you know, slice this in half and use it that way. This is their after bath oil. I got mine in Coco Mango, the scent. And it can be used on your hair or body. I plan on using it for the body, but we'll see. Maybe hair. I'll test it out. This is the Honey Hemp Conditioner. I reviewed this in the past. Got one small bottle of this. I see on the website now they sell this in really large sizes. Like um, you could get it. What was it? It was something really huge like you would use at a salon. Uh, now this is Hervada. So I got three of the Cocosta um, oils. And two of the Avo Soya oils. Because I love the scent of those. Actually they all smell good. So I got those. It can be used on hair or body. And I reviewed these in the past too. Also from Hervada, I got two bottles of the Amla shampoo. So two of those. Now, um, Hervada also has some products for the body. I didn't realize this jar would be so small. But I got one of these uh, body lotions, buttercream. So I got that. I got two of their, this was listed as new on the website, two of their uh, shampoo bars. And it comes with, in a little box, has a little card to tell you about how you should use this particular shampoo bar. And it has a pretty nice scent to it. See, this is what it looks like. This is the size, width. Okay. And I got two of those. Okay. Uh, oh, also from Hair Veda, um, they have now body products, as I mentioned. So this is the Coco Mango. No, this is not. This is Orange Cream Body Soap. And mango chutney soap. So I have these two soaps. Next is, oh, she sent it. I've reviewed this in the past as well. This is the banana, uh, banana brulee moisturizing deep conditioner. I like it. This is the same thing, except I wanted to try it in a different scent. I, I believe when I first started getting this, it was only available in the natural banana scent. It has real bananas in here. Um, good product. So now she has it available in different scents and I got this one in black coconut. As you can see, I've already been dipping in it and using it. So it's good. And then I got, this is something I had never purchased from She Sent It before because I had purchased in the past a lot of her leave-ins, a few of her leave-ins and I, they didn't all do what I wanted. I mean, there was one in particular that I don't even think I reviewed on the site because Anyway, I just wasn't, you know, it wasn't my cup of tea. But this one is the leave-in conditioner, the Cocoa Cream Leave-In Conditioner. And again, this is not the review portion. I'm just showing you the haul, but can you see how much I use? Okay, if that's any indication. What else? Oh, this I got from Sephora. This is um one of their limited edition still a pots they're cream and I'll do a separate post on this but these are small and I'll show you just how small cream uh, eye liners right so they come in different colors I have a, a black a vibrant purple 
this kind of tan and this color is called I think uh, starry night so it's another dark one and it comes with this little stick to apply it and it says that the value is $95 but I paid 32 I also got a little gift box from Afro, um, Afro from Aveda which I purchased this is one of their uh, this is the Caribbean rejuvenation kit and I feel very strongly about this as well that review is coming up soon because I've used this for a while I'll just show you what's in here you get the Caribbean soap you can see it's just a, a small soap nothing huge you get the um, a body also from the same scent um, Caribbean therapy body cleanser you get a scrub also again Caribbean therapy and the final thing is the Caribbean therapy um, body wash so you get a wash a cream soap and this scrub so this is the Black Friday part two sorry it looks so disorganized now but Black Friday part two haul and as the other Black Friday items arrive I'll just you know mention them separately and just show you what I purchased what a difference a day makes the footage that you just watched is everything I had received up until Friday which was yesterday today Saturday and I received a ring at the door and it was my Rosalind Scents uh, Black Friday purchase well actually I think I got it on Saturday but you know big difference it was still on sale in fact she always runs sales so that wasn't I don't even know if that was something specifically for Black Friday or just I mean she always has stuff on sale so it's great these are body butters. I reviewed them in the past. She has wonderful body butters. They're so soft, just melt so easily and just absorb right into your skin. They feel great. And the thing that I really, that's unique, I should say, about Rosalind Scents is that Scents is in her name. So she has uh, scents that are customizable. It's not like you just go to a store and she has, you know, some of the scents that she's already created, her standard scents, but she can also customize and make other scents. So this time I wanted to try some of her other scents. This one is Egyptian Cotton. I also got, and she has bigger jars than this too. Um, the Passion Body Butter. This one is the Baby Doll Body Butter. They all smell different and so nice. Let me, this one smells like something like sweet. It's not overwhelming, but it's like something, a, a perfumed baby powder type of scent, I guess. Maybe that's how I can describe it. The passion smells almost fruity, but with this like uh, perfume scent on top of it. So it smells more mature. It's not like you're walking out smelling like, you know, just a strawberry. So that's great. Egyptian cotton. You know, I was skeptical just with the name Egyptian cotton. I was skeptical as to whether or not I would like this scent. Would it be too musky or something? But it's not. It's not. The cotton kind of levels things out. It smells, it's clean, but It's a clean scent. It's, it's very nice though. I like it. I don't even know what scent that's comparable to, but it's, it's good. And then this one, last but not least, is the Mango Sugar Body Butter, which smells like a sweet mango fruit, but you know, the perfume version of it. So I love it. And this da -da -da -da, is a special PJD scent that she created. It's PJD. Yay. She gave me my own scent. So this is nice. It smells a little like um, baby powder but with something sweet layered on top of it very nice and the other thing that I love about her uh, body butter is not just the fact that they have great ingredients I mean listen to this um, shea butter cocoa butter almond oil aloe vera oil vitamin E and of course you know the fra fragrance and everything for the scent so she has great ingredients the scent smell great you can customize the scents but also the other thing I love let me see if I can zoom in is how well she whips these. Look how soft. Look at, see, well, you see, and I'm not even pressing hard. Look how it I just dent my finger in there. And as you rub it on, do you see the oil? Look at that. Just smooth that all over your skin when you're coming out of the shower, or wherever. So that's nice. I got the small size. I can just throw this in my purse. And when my sister 
smell this she saw my um goodie bag she said oh wow i don't even have to wear perfume anymore this is this is it because it really is um something that will stick with you and i've reviewed this in the past but great sense thank you if you're watching rosalind for the customized scent here that's great and it came in this cute organza bag i should also show you that i got some fizzy bath salts and also some different scents in here oops and the fizzy bath also came in this nice red organza bag and some of these scents, let me just read them off to you. These like little samples. Queen by Queen Latifah. Uh, let's see. Light. What is this? Light Red by D&G, which I'm assuming is Dolce and Gabbana. Island Fiji by M. Kors. So I guess it smells similar to something by Michael Kors. I've, I've never um, used his stuff, so I don't know. And Apple Bottoms by Nelly. So those are some great scents I can try. And this is another piece of Black Friday. All right. Thanks for watching. I, I doubt Afro Veda will be delivered today, though. I did see confirmation that it's on its way. So yay. That's going to end my Black Friday stuff. Talk to you soon. Bye-bye.